aim to test for the presence of sugar in urine sample materials required test tube test tube stand urine sample benedict solution spirit lamp test tube holder match box dropper first we will take the urine sample in a test tube we'll add 2 to 3 ml of the urine sample in the test tube then we'll add the benedict solution with the help of a dropper into the test tube now we are going to heat the test tube holding it with the help of test tube holder under the spirit lamp and we have to keep the test tube in slanting position and give it intermittent heating we can observe the change in color of the sample presence of sugar in urine aim to test for the presence of sugar in urine materials required test tube test tube stand urine sample burner test tube holder benedict solution procedure benedict's test take 2 ml of the urine sample in a test tube and add 2 ml of the benedict solution boil it and then cool it to room temperature felling test add felling solution a and felling solution b to the urine sample and then cool it to the room temperature greenish yellow yellowish red and reddish yellow precipitate will be formed conclusion green precipitate shows traces Yellow precipitate shows moderate and brick red precipitate shows intense quantity of glucose in the urine sample. In Felling's test, greenish yellow, yellowish red or reddish orange precipitate shows the presence of traces, moderate and large quantity of glucose respectively in the urine sample. Precautions: Wash the test tubes thoroughly before use. use standard reagents why were questions under which conditions the sugar is excreted through urine which test is used to detect the presence of sugar in urine sample what is the presence of glucose in urine called as